Hi there, just thought I'd do a few short videos. Just go through the day by day of my Octopus heat pump installation. So this is the end of day one. Lads arrived about 20 to 8 this morning. Um, it's half four now, they left not long ago. Grafted all day. I uh, don't think they even stopped with any lunch or any food or anything. Um, wouldn't take any baking salamis, drinks, coffee, anything. They wouldn't take it, but anyhow. Um, I'll show you around what they've done so far. Uh, at the end of day one, and then I'll continue um, showing you each day how we progress. Uh, the heat pump's here, hasn't been fitted because one of the legs was missing. You're gonna have to pick that up in the morning before they um, come through. Said they're gonna be here about the same sort of time. It's a pipe ready to be put in. The heat pump's gonna be put um, under the window there. The run is gonna go up to the right there. Then along the wall to where the scaffolding is and into where the cupboard is. That's where the tank is at the moment. The kitchen. Um, I've took out the old radiator and put in a K3, um, which was required for the extra heat. They were going to put two in originally. I said they'll have to run another pipe down um, through the corner there. And they said, well, we might as well just put a, a bigger radiator in to start with. Sorry for the dog. Uh, in the sitting room, they replaced the radiator here. Um, it's about the same size as the previous one, but obviously this is a newer one. The one I was in was, with, um, I think, it'd been in since the, the house was built in the seventies. Uh, now two upstairs, we'll show you there. Another radiator replaced is the one in the bathroom. It was originally a towel radiator and they were going to put a, um, a really big one, it would have went right up to the ceiling um, but they said they couldn't get that now um, and would I be happy with just this and, to be honest I don't really hang towels and things on them maybe one towel so that'll be good enough for me um, the other radiator that they've done is this one in the spare room so again it was just a slightly bigger radiator um, that one, that's the dog again, because she'll have to leave us alone. And into where they're putting the tank. The tank's in place, um, all the pipe work, everything hooked up. Look at the ceiling. I had to get this ceiling replaced um, because it had asbestos in it. So I got something to remove it, and then I just boarded it up again. Uh, I'll show you in the loft, but there's not actually been much done by the looks of it in the loft, but I'll, uh, I'll show you what they've done so far anyhow. Okay, up in the loft, there's my old Baxi boiler, which is still in place, and he said he's, I'm quite lucky, because I'm gonna have hot water at night, and um, still, he's just cut off and capped. One of those, couldn't tell you which one it is. Um, the volume eyes, I said, he couldn't fit in the cupboard, so I asked if it was okay to put it here somewhere, I said, yeah, no problem, I believe he's putting it where the boiler is. All the other bits, it's the pipe work. So the pipe work's coming up from the cupboard, ready to be piped in properly in the loft. 